is meant to be a guiding star, the most crucial conversation of your day with God. Prayer can set the tone of your day. It helps to make better decisions. It helps us to build stronger relationships. I now call upon Dhruv to lead us into prayer. Please join your hands for the prayer. Father, we thank you for the night and for the pleasant morning light. For rest and food and loving care and all that makes the world so fair. Help us to do the things we should. To be to others kind and good in all we do, in all we say. To groom loving every day. A very good morning. Director Reverend Father Crispino de Sula. A principal Reverend Father Bonat Fernandez. Our Vice Principal, Sir Clifford de Souza, our AHM, Mrs. Christina Mascarenas, our Supervisor, Ms. Anita Phillip, our Substitute Supervisor, Ms. Lakshmi Krishna, teachers and all my dear friends. Happiness begins from the moment you do something for others. The purpose of life is to serve others with sincerity. Only then it is fruitful. Think about it. Do any trees eat their own fruit? No. Service to mankind is service to God. When you serve others, God rewards you with true happiness. Class 7C welcomes you all to this virtual assembly. Being of service to others is what brings to happiness, pertaining to a theme for this academic year committed citizens rebuilding a fragile world. Meditation is the journey from sound to silence, from movement to stillness, from limited identity to unlimited space. It reveals the most profound and awesome dimensions of the world you live in. Let us spend a few moments in silence so as to gain compassion and kindness in the right way. I call upon Mrs. Bella to lead us into meditation. Sit in a comfortable position. Take a deep breath in and a deep breath out. Don't be a parrot in life. A parrot talks way too much, but cannot fly high in the sky, where it, an eagle is silent, but has the willpower to touch the sky. There are five mentality of an eagle, which you can incorporate in your life and see the change in your life. First, eagles fly alone at high altitude. Eagles don't fly with crows and ravens. Eagles hang around with eagles, meaning stay away from narrow-minded people who will bring you down. People you hang around will determine the person you become. So always keep good company. Second, eagles have vision. They have an ability to focus. No matter what the obstacles are, meaning have a vision and remain focused in your life and you will always succeed. Don't ever give up. The 
third one eagle of fearless eagle do not surrender to its prey they will always give a good fight meaning whatever problem comes in your life do not panic do not surrender face it and fight it eagles are tenacious during storm eagle use the storm wind to lift high in the sky to glide and give their wings a rest meaning one should not be afraid of challenges but use them profitably eagles possess vitality when eagles grow old their feathers turn weak and they cannot fly high in the sky so it plucks out the weak feather breaks its beak and claws he waits till new feathers beak and claws grow out it's a very painful process but it comes out flying higher than ever meaning we need to shed off our old habits which burden us even though it is very painful remember boy no pain no gain keep the past to the past live in the present and dream of your future good morning to one and all have a great day full of vision trend vitality focus and positivity there is a tiny saying that goes if you want happiness for an hour take a nap if you want happiness for a day go fishing but if you want happiness for a lifetime help somebody happiness is found in helping others we shall now see a small skit called a good samaritan On a fine day, few friends decided to watch a call each other to have a general chat. Hello, I am Paramji. It's been months since I last spoke to my friends. Let me call them. Come on, pick up, pick up the call. Oh, here they are. Hey Alex, Vijay and Arif, my dear friends. How have you all been? I have missed you all. Oh, we missed you too and your jokes. Ha ha, very funny. And Vijay, how has you been and everyone at home? All good here, but it's no fun without you all. That's true. Where is Rohan? He will join us soon. Yeah. Yeah. Hello everyone. How have you all been? Hi Rohan. We all are good. And by the way, what took you so long to join the chat? I was actually placing the order for my neighbor Uncle Ram. He's too old and does not have any knowledge about technology. So oh, what? Your neighbor might be having his own family. They can help him. Why should we care? It's not like that. Actually, my neighbor Uncle Ram's son is a doctor. He has been given the duty to attend COVID positive patients. Ram Uncle doesn't want to trouble his son too. Last Sunday, when Ram Uncle tried calling the service, he accidentally dialed my number. After getting to know the situation, I decided to do this little act of kindness. Wow, Rohan, that's really good. Even I can help others the same way you did. If we can't help others be physically present, at least virtual way we can. No way, Rohan. We would love to meet Uncle Ram. Yes, for sure. Let me call him. Hello, 
Hello, can you hear me? Yes, uncle, we can. Hello, young boys. How are you all? I must mention about your friend Rohan, who has been a good Samaritan to me. Good Samaritan? What does that mean? It means he has been helping me out in every possible way. His little act of service means a lot, and I encourage you all to help each other. Sorry to interrupt, but helping you, uncle, gave me immense joy and happiness. Yes, surely, uncle. For I have learned today that being of service to others is what brings true happiness and joy. Like this, the chat continued for a long time, but Ruben friend learned something new from it. Volunteering your time and energy to help other make you and the world beautiful. So always offer a helping hand in those in need. We would now like to present a video Lean On Me. Sometimes in our lives We all have pain And we all have sorrow But if we are wise We know that there's There's always tomorrow Lean on me When you're not strong And I'll be free I'll help you carry on, lean on me It won't be long, till I'm gonna need Somebody to lean on Please, swallow your pride If I have that you need to borrow For no one can feel those of you need that you won't let so lean on me when you're not strong and I'll be friend I'll help you carry on lean on me it won't be long till I'm gonna need somebody to lean on Helping others sometimes calls for great sacrifices, but at the end of the day, it is all worth it. Some people work round the clock to serve others. These people are worthy of praise, worthy of salute. I now call upon Rustam and Jokris, who will recite a poem. Virus. The world is getting wounded and every life is counted. With the time on the clock flaking, how are we going to save the living? It is actually a respiratory disease. The symptoms are fever or even a sneeze. The virus is new in town. The other viruses had to bow down. It wears a crown of spikes and is called Coronavirus, its nickname is COVID-19 and nobody has made its vaccine. There is no treatment, surgery or cure. The lesser precautions we take, the higher it will soar. Doctors, nurses, policemen are all willing to risk their lives for this pandemic. So let us stay at home and kill this virus. Let us build around the house an antivirus room. Use mask as a shield, sanitizer as a sword. Then wiping off the virus will be easy as playing any musical chord. Let us meditate to attain the power from the Almighty. Before this virus is uncontrollable and turns nasty. Please, please, please. 
be at home and be safe what's broken can be mended what's hurt can be healed no matter how dark it gets remember the sun is gonna rise again on that positive note how about some music to feed your souls i now call upon nishit jain the budding musician of don bosco high school who will entertain you with his soulful music
make the difference in our plans. You and me, I rock to tea, and that means we can do. Come on, let's go. Fifteen, yeah. We can do. Yeah. Dancing is like a body work, but with fun. It is good for your heart and helps with balance and coordination. In this pandemic times, it relieves stress and is an innovative way to bond with others. So let's bring everyone together and cheer them on with a dance performance. Lights, camera. And music. I'm at home. If you ever find yourself stuck in the middle of the sea, I'll sail the world to find you. If you ever find yourself lost in the dark and you can't see, I'll be the light to guide you. Find out what we're made of when we are called to help our friends in need. You can count on me like one, two, three, I'll be there. And I know when I need it, I can count on you like four, three, two, you'll be there. Cause that's what friends are supposed to do, oh yeah. Ooh, 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 yeah, yeah. If you're tossing and you're turning and you just can't fall asleep. I'll sing a song beside you And if you ever forget how much you really mean to me Every day I will remind you Oh, find out what we're made of When we are called to help our friends in need you can count on me like one, two, three, I'll be there. And I know when I need it, I can count on you like four, three, two, you'll be there. Cause that's what friends are supposed to do, oh yeah. Ooh. Monologue is a long speech by one or two actors. It is a conversation with the audience. It serves a specific purpose and shares internal thoughts to give specific details. I call upon Rudra and his guide to perform a monologue on coronavirus. The problem is, we think we all are genius. The problem is, we don't want to listen to anyone. Now getting to work from home, but we want to go out to work. All the big companies are saying, work from home, work from home, but we want to save the economy. Listen, if our economy falls, the economy of all the places in the world will fall. Together we'll save it. Those people are going to the park to work. Those people are going to Uncle and Auntie's birthday parties. Those people are going to play cricket with friends on the turf. Guys, summer vacations have not started. You all should be ashamed of yourselves. IPL, NBA, F1, Premier League, school exams, college exams, everything has stopped. Movie releases have been stopped. But you all have not stopped. Restaurant owners were worried that they have to pack up and leave due to this pandemic. But instead, there are long queues waiting to get inside. 
fact, before, the pandemic restaurants closed at 12 p.m. But now, they open till 2 in the morning. People are putting captions on their photos. Strong Nutella waffles is helping me beat coronavirus stress. The real stress has already started. We have passed phase 2 and have reached phase 3. God save us. See China and Italy. Then you will understand what I am saying. The government is saying stay home and stay safe. But the people are catching trains to go to Juhu Beach to eat Pav Baji. If this continues, the trains will stop running. If your friend asks you to go out, refrain. Say no. Sit home and convince your friends to sit home too. Make everyone aware of social distancing till the government gives us the good news. Medicines have been made. Vaccines have been tried out. The problem is everywhere. If we are all united, we will find the solution. Trust yourselves and trust others. Please party Corona. Please travel Corona. Please meetings Corona. Please obi marriage Corona. Please shake hands Corona. Please let's stop this Corona. Mahatma Gandhi once said, the best way to find yourself is to lose yourself in the service of others. The more we get, the more we I would now like to call upon our rector, Reverend Father Crispino de Souza, to share his thoughts. Good morning to all and congratulations to the 7C for this wonderful assembly uh, on happiness through service. Uh, it, it was a very creative and innovative way of uh, bringing out the theme of your assembly, you know, through monologues, uh, uh, poetry, dance, uh, song, a whole lot of ways and a skit in the beginning. So congratulations to Ravina, your class teacher. I think Bella also had a handle in this. Yeah. So, well done, uh, all the teachers and the students involved in today's assembly. Now, just to share a thought with you, you know, uh, this thing called happiness, uh, it is very essential to live a healthy life. And it has got something physical attached to it. Uh, you know, whenever we lack certain hormones, no, uh, then we tend to become sad, and uh, when certain hormones increase, then we tend to become happy. And one of the most important hormones in our body that makes us happy, I'm sure you're aware of it, it is called oxytocin. Oxytocin is the hormone for happiness. So if you have a high level of oxytocin in your body, then you will always be happy. But if you have a low level of oxytocin, then you will be depressed, you will be uh, sad, you will think of committing suicide and all these things happen when these hormones are very low in your body. And uh, it is a scientific fact you know, that when you reach out to others in service, when you do something good to others, uh, naturally your body secretes this hormone called oxytocin. And that is why when we help others, we become happy. You know? uh, it is a known fact that if you want to be happy, you have to make others happy. That is the only formula for happiness. Uh, no matter how much things you do to yourself, no matter how much money you have, no matter how big a house you may have, no matter the best car you may have or whatever gadget you may have, you will not be happy. But the best way of uh, you know, uh, increasing the level of oxytocin in your body is by being of service to others, especially those who are in need, uh, those who are suffering, those who cannot pay you back. And... Uh, you know, if you look at your life, uh, at least when I look at my life, I realize God has blessed me with so much. 
materially uh, even uh, intellectually uh, emotionally spiritually but these gifts are given to us you no know, uh, not for our own self glory these gifts are given to us so that we may be able to share it with others and when we share these gifts with others then that hormone oxytocin will be formed in our body and then we will be happy so my only prayer and wish for you is that uh, you may really reach out like that uh, boy in the skit i really liked his gesture of going out and helping that ram uncle you know uh, because he was in need he was alone there are so many people like that today who are alone who are suffering who are in need and if we really reach out to those people you know uh, without uh, thinking of anything what we can receive in return then we will really be happy in our lives good morning and have a happy day thank you father for those kind words i would now like to call upon our principal father uh, father crispino de souza to share his thoughts good morning to all of you yeah, that father clifford has to come somewhere in the picture okay <laughs> yes in the first place i wish to congratulate Ms. Ravina and the entire class, along with Ms. Pela, also was part of this preparation. As also I can see, okay, uh, though it was not expressed, uh, the hand also of the parents in the preparation of their children for this assembly. So congratulations, as Father Rector rightly put, the this assembly today was well prepared. and the theme was beautifully executed uh, to a very creative uh, to very creative means that was at your that were at your disposal father rector i wish to thank you for your presence and also for your message i think he has given us the formula for happiness uh, you know that was integrated in uh, different forms that were presented at the assembly today we are going through all that took place at the assembly the meditation that spoke on silence as well as on the story of the eagle the good samaritan the skit the video the poetry the flute uh, the singing i think after a long time i heard a, a person singing a young boy singing and keeping the pitch right through so i think it was ezekiel who sang a new student okay to the school congratulations uh, the dance was fantastic okay of these four boys well coordinated well rehearsed and practiced uh, overall what i want to comment on is the beautiful script that was written you know and that conveyed the theme of today's assembly whoever has written the script and uh, you know I, i believe it's a combined effort but it is beautifully done okay i quite like the script and uh, the compares also did a wonderful job of taking us to this assembly so congratulations to all the compares who have practiced hard and ensured that we had a lovely assembly today uh, after watching your assembly it is very evident very clear that you have planned a lot for this assembly days and days of assemb- of of planning well rehearsed and also well executed and i was just thinking to myself if your virtual assembly was so good imagine what would have been what the the assembly would have been in the gymnasium okay in the hall it would really have been good okay so kudos congratulations and uh, happy day to all of you okay god bless you well done thank you father thank you father
Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father, for those kind words. Lend a hand to one another in the daily toil of life. When we meet a weaker brother, let us help him in the strife. Last but not the least, we would like to thank Miss Bella for the script and direction of the assembly. A big thanks to our class teacher, Ms. Vina for constantly motivating us and guiding us to showcase our talents. So ladies and gentlemen, this is Jimit Shah signing out from Don Bosco High School, Class 7C. Goodbye. See you, Sayonara. Stay home, stay safe. God bless you all. Ravina. Yes, yes, sir. First of all, I want to thank you for the beautiful invite. <laughs> so nice yeah. it was. Okay. And congratulations to the to Ravina and the boys of 7C for an outstanding performance. Really very nice assembly. Thanks to Bella for her meditation. No pain, no gain. Yes, that's it. Okay. Then for the nice video presentation, the song was very nice. Up. Okay. Lean on me. And also Nishad Jain, who played the flute, okay? Really, that piece was really beautiful. And then uh, Ezekiel for his song, for his melodious voice, very nice. The dance also was nicely choreographed. And also the monologue. Compass, you all did your work excellent, okay? So I got one line from that compare when you're saying, if you want happiness for a lifetime, help somebody. Okay, so once more, congratulations and God bless you all. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Yeah, Nishit Chain, you have to keep up the practicing your flute. Okay, it will become good. Okay, sir. Good morning, Rubina. Good morning, Miss. Good morning, Mr. Lovely Lovely assembly. assembly. That was a lovely assembly. Uh, I. I messaged father in the middle of it. We haven't had Rael Padamsi for one year, but our kids have not forgotten pronunciation. So it's evident still. They still speak well. And there's one kid that I recognize and know very, very strongly from your class. I'm so happy that you gave him a chance to speak. Yes, you're good. And I missed you on the day on which you, your mom came to give in the papers. The rest of the kids all have done so well. And like father said, if it was so good in the virtual, I can just imagine what it would have been in the real. Well done. Keep it up. Congratulations, Ravina and the class. Yesterday itself, I've told you they were really, really good. The first time I saw them itself, they spoke so, they're speaking so well, each one of them. It, uh, that shows that they've also practiced and, and that too at the time when, you know, we just finished with our uh, assessments. So that was that was really good. All the best, boys. Thank you, Miss. And all the efforts of the boys, the parents, Miss Bella, everyone. It's, it was a teamwork. So thanks uh, a lot to everyone who contributed to this assembly. Ravina, you and your boys have done very well. Really, I'm very happy with you. Thank you so much, sir. So, boys, I want to tell you also that uh, this year, Father, uh, not Father, Sir Rai, celebrates, celebrates his 50 years at Don Bosco Matunga. Okay, it's a golden jubilee year for him. We congratulate him. We shall have a special program, God willing. Okay, yeah. And let's give him a big round of applause also for all that he does. Yeah. Thank, thank you, you Sir Rai. Yeah. Thank yeah. you, Father. Thank you. Yeah. So, Ravina, once again, congratulations. Well done. Okay, we take your leave. Well done, Thank boys. You. Well done. God bless you. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Thank you, Miss Bella. Thank you, Father. Yeah, bye, bye, bye. Thank you, Father. Bye. Bye, Miss. Thank you.
Yes, and thank you so much. Uh, it was really a good assembly. Thank you for all the teamwork, the cooperation, and the support. Continue doing the good work and support each other. Okay, and we make a very good team. Okay, so keep the whole team spirit alive. Okay. Thank you, thank you so much. Bye. Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye